um, loads of information there, and then you always get down to the differential equation here for the simple harmonic motion, or d2x by dt squared plus 320x equals zero. You've got m squared plus 320 equals zero. So m equals square root of 320, so that's 64 times 5, isn't it? 8 root 5i. So the general solution a cos 8 root 5t plus b sine 8 root 5. Differentiating it, because we'll probably need to, gives us 8 root 5 a sine t, and that one's negative, plus 8 root 5 b cos 8 root 5 t for that bit there. We're told that when t is equal to 0, x is equal to 8. So 8 is equal to a, the rest of it's just 0. And we're also told that the velocity at that point there is zero so again we've got a zero equals b coming through here again so like the last one we've just got x equals eight cos eight root five t as the equation and nothing more the period of the resulting oscillations we say eight root five t was going to be two pi and so t is 2 pi divided by 8 root 5. Uh, you could tidy that up as well. Um, something over 40, isn't it? 2 root 5 over 40, I think. Um, and you could tap it in the calculator for a decimal as well.